Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, friends. This is Genshan back at it again with more indie gaming content. This time I'm gonna play Kaiju, Kaiju Dating Sim demo. This game is made by Squitter Shins and um, published by Top Hat Studios. Well, basically, this is a dating sim game about kaijus. Dating sim game, kaiju. I never thought that those two words will ever, well, three words, will ever be in like, in one sentence. Well, anyway, let's start and uh, see what we got. Okay. Okay. Uh, Giga choose pronouns. Uh, choo choo. She, her, he, him, they, Zezer, Viver, Per, Per. What the? I mean, sure. I guess there's a lot. I'm gonna go with choo choo, I guess. I don't know what that means, anyway. Hello. Uh, Brevity, welcome to the Kaiju demo. I am Brevity Orms, and this is my co-host, Lucky Cole, with world-breaking news. <gasps> Lucky, ladies and gentlemen, Ramon Nomar was my world, and the news is that we broke up. Who is Ramon Omar? Oh, Lucky, I'm so sorry to hear that. Huh. Also, a, coloss a colossal creature has appeared near, uh, near the North Pole. Mm. Are you bringing up the Kaiju to deflect from addressing your breakup? Yeah. Yeah, but the gigantic kaiju known as Gigachu is also a significant story. Ah. We may be buried the Lede Lee. How do you read that? Lady? Lede? <gasps> there. Uh, like Ramon Nomar buried my heart. Uh. Let's go to the satellite footage, shall we? Let's go. Mm. Okay, so I guess I'm I'm Gigachu. Are you hiding your feelings behind satellite footage again? Well. I also wanted to show Gigachu moving via the keyboard. Uh, or control. Aww. It's healthy to cry, Lucky. Uh, More on the story as it develops. I'm moving. So I can go with the butterfly thing. Or the smoking hot lady over there. Let's start with a butterfly. Start oh. with a relationship. A massive mossy moth mystically man manifested from the mist of Carmana Walburn Provincial Park. Mm. The locals call this monster Mothra. F Moth, yeah. Mothra. Um, you know. The. Uh, Godzilla. Uh, after the legendary planned protector that would defend Vancouver and all of Canada in a time of crisis. Oh. Gigachu may have met Chu's match in Mosra. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, that was it. That was it? Oh, okay. Mount Sidley. I don't know where I was going. I was just oh. looking at stuff. Mosra and Gigachu get up close and personal at Mount Sidley. Hmm. What has driven the kaiju to bully our beloved Mount Sidley? Well. There's a language of love in the leveling of landmarks, Lucky, and each strike can communicate compatibility. What? What you talking about, Brevity? Are you suggesting that kaiju are wooed by Guanta and destruction? Yes. Indeed, and Mothra is waiting for Gigachu's reply right now. I'll try to narrate the date as we go live on the scene. Here, let's go ahead and see what we'll do. Mm. Does Gigachu come here often? Really? There you go. I need to like... I guess I need to like... Go with what Mothra's preference is? Mothra doesn't uh, stray far from home either, okay? How does Mothra look? Beautiful. What? Mothra may have a misunderstood accompaniment. What? What? Is this Chu's first time dating a plant? Yeah? She liked it. We're just trying this. We're just trying to imagine. Mothra likes that Gigachu is branching out. Mothra wants to know what most attracted Gigachu to her. Sight, smell, or sound? Um... Sight? He's, a, he's okay with it. Yeah, Chu's okay with it. I, I don't know wh what pronoun to use. So I'm just gonna go with Chu because I'm Chu as well. Gigachu might be too into Mothra's verdant cur curves. Does Gigachu like Mount Sidley? No. Yeah, because she's a bug, or choose a bug, so I'm not sure if he, she like choose Chu likes cold weather. They only came for the company and don't mind in the least. Does Gigachu kiss on the first day? No? Okay, she's kinda okay with it. Nice. I'm just trying the mountain now. Gigachu is not feeling it quite yet. Are we gonna kiss? Oh, just just a flying kids, I guess. Quite nice. Budding romance, Act One. 
Okay, are we gonna do something in Moai or Mano del Desierto? Actually, let's go with the Statue of Liberty. Let's destroy that motherfucking Statue of Liberty. Uh, I did not expect a clash between Kaiju to be so underwhelming. We should expect them to be compatible in every area. I've been on at least a dozen dates that were more destructive than what we witnessed. They just need time to grow and get to know each other. I guess we're still getting to know Gigachu ourselves. <laughs> now that I'm like kind of, I'm kind of like picturing like kaiju's in the real world dating and destroying shit while they're dating as well. So yeah, that that's that's yeah, that's weird and dangerous. Yeah, very dangerous. Might 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 destroy a world or something like that. Um, some experts are speculating that Gigachu is the manifestation of humanity's loss of connection as we digitize ourselves, our lives. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Lucy? No. Or Lucky? Disconnected? My phone is like a digital digital umbilical cord. Mother has already called and texted me twice during this segment. Huh. Don't worry, Mom. I'll go get your groceries once we finish broadcasting. Sure. Oh. I mean, like, yeah, yeah, I know phones can be, like, addictive with internet and all that. But it's still something that gives us convenience. And not just convenience, but also, uh, like, uh, security, safety, quick response, like, you know? If there would be like a crime that'll happen in a certain place without phones, how would people know? And like information as well. Media can be controlled the less we have access to uh, internet, public, um, public, like internet, public, like whatever, public access to like whatever. Yeah, you know what I'm trying to say. Anyway. Back to the game. It looks like Gigachu is trying to connect right now at the st Statue of Liberty. Okay, so we're here with Mosra and me, Ooh. Gigachu. Who's Gigachu's hero? Um, Haruo Nakajim. I, I, I'd say mom. She likes it. Mosra likes it. <laughs> ah, me too, Gigachu. Because mm. I, I kind of feel like Mosra. Mosra is a type that is like a new to relationships so i think marshall wants like wholesome stuff and not really like the one that has like a lot of dates or such what's gigachu's takes on walls bad oh oh you like walls Gigachu doesn't get what monster sees in walls uh me too actually what social cause is most important to Gigachu? deforestation this enfranchisement and Education. Okay, deforestation, because like basically nature freak. Well, we are all nature freaks. I mean, not we, but like the kaiju. Uh, Monster in favor of protecting her own. Nice. What is Gigachu's diet like? Gigachu, I'd say herbivore, because Monster is. Monster looks like an her a herbivore. What? Uncomfortable with plant-based diets? Why? Is Gigachu into piercings? No. Okay, see? Destroy that. Destroy. Both prefer to be... Oh, natural. Is Gigachu kiss on the second date? Nice. Let's go! Are we gonna kiss now? Chu does! Oh, we're gonna kiss! Oh, that's cute and also kind of weird but it's cute I guess we need to destroy all of these big tower over it big Ben brevity do you know the number one question on our viewers minds does Giga you poop I guess that I mean that's not one of the first questions that I'll be asking if I see a kaiju, but but it could be one of the questions if I like really think about it. No, no, that's number two. Okay, of course. Ooh, number two. Yeah, the question that is intriguing our audience is how you are so in tune with the intentions of these kaiju. Is it your degree in communications? Well. I practice Ishin Denshin Do. What the hell is that? What? 
Is that some strange monster dialect? Do you speak kaiju? Uh -uh. No, it's listening to the heart. Hmm. What's your impression on Mothra? Ah. She seeks a similarity nurturing parental partner. Ah. Will, incompatible, will incompatible answers come off as incompetent? <laughs> Commitment seems more important than competence to Mothra. Ah. I think so. With time and dedication, their compatibility should naturally grow where it matters most. Oh. Let's see your insight and action and learn more of Big Bad now. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Mm -hmm. Can Gigachu be with someone who didn't share or choose political beliefs? Not really, I don't care. Unless it gets annoying, like for me personally. Neither one has a strong political preference. Mm -hmm. That's great. Is Gigachu multilingual? Yeah? Okay. I like it, I like it. Ah. Monster admires Gigachu's drive. Mm. Is Gigachu fashionable? Yes. Ah. His monster's design is kind of like it looks fashionable. Gigachu knows that there's nothing as fashionable as one's own foliage. Is Gigachu big on bridges? Not really. There we go. I did okay. I did okay with it. Monster can just fly across. So what does Gigachu attribute to success? Hard work? Okay, maybe a combination would be better. Oh, just a flying kiss this time. <laughs> Look at monsters. Okay, like I said, I guess I need to like fill that up. How about not kill him in Jara? Uh, Gravity, I don't think I'm getting the hang of this Ishin Denshin Dosa. Uh -huh. Why do you say that, Lucky? Huh. Uh, why do you say that, Lucky? I'm unsure about how that date went. Mm. The kaiju aren't so certain either. Hmm. Gravity, do kaiju like the landmarks that they choose to level? Yes. They generally seem to favor them. Uh, what about the landmarks they dislike? Well... Not every kiss needs to be French. I guess so. I mean, of course. Of course not. That'd be so... Maybe for the first few times that you're gonna, like... You're kinda still thirsty to each other, but like... For the most part, you don't really need that. <laughs> <laughs> Tell that to my landscaper. Oh. The unstoppable kaiju couple Mossichu just landed Mossichu just landed at Mount Kilimanjaro. Let's go live to the scene. Okay, let's kill this. Mountain. Does Gigachu follow current events? I do. Mosra does. Mosra does it. Mosra likes it. Mosra wants awareness in her partner. Nice. Mm -hmm. Is Gigachu artis artistic? Yes. I'm not artistic in real life, but like, I always just trying to hit that. It is a talent lost in Lost Run. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. What is Gigachu's favorite animal? Sloth, tardigrade, or lemming? Lemming and sloth are like mammals, and tardigrade is like a weird kind of insect, right? Like the water bear or whatever. The immortal, immortal microscopic organism uh monster is impressed by the tardigrades uh disordered protein cocoon mm -hmm. how does gigachu feel about wood i feel great about wood because you're a wood person or kaiju like you like nature both are surprisingly pro plant mm -hmm. monster wants to know what most attracted gigachu to her i'll go with compassion there you go gotcha i know what you like monster Another kiss. Oh, Stop. It's weird. <laughs> oh. This is the end of the Kaichu demo. Wait, that was it? I thought I need to like at least get the full thing. Okay, cool. Oh. But the relationship was just getting serious. Well. Demos are for flirting, not going steady. I I guess. I guess you're right. Hmm. <laughs> what if players are ready for a little more commitment? Then they should pick up the full game and take their kaiju relationship to the next level. Ta-da! And that was it. Kaiju or Kaichu Kaiju Dating Sim demo. That was nice. That was a That was an experience, I'd say. If you wanna try it out though, I'll leave the links uh, Steam store page down in the description so that you could try the demo. Uh, this game will be out on summer 2022. So if you wanna catch it, go ahead and wishlist it. That will uh, 
that'll help the developers and uh that's it for this video if you like it give it a like if you're not if not give it a dislike let me know in the comments below why if you have any in the game recommendations or have anything to say to me and uh hit the subscribe button so that you'll get more or see more indie gaming content from me that's it for me have a great day night wherever you are goodbye bye